What if I told you that one of the most advanced tanks of the Cold War, the Object 279, a 60-ton armored fortress built to survive the apocalypse, isn't just real, but almost perfectly recreated in War Thunder? Today, we're taking a closer look at the Object 279's in-game performance and comparing it to what historical data actually says. Out of all the tanks in War Thunder, the Object 279 stands as one of the most historically faithful. Its weight, crew layout, dimensions, engine power, and even the complex four-track suspension are nearly identical to the real thing. Gaijin didn't just approximate this vehicle, they got it right. The only real deviations come down to its ammunition. The BR-482B, its main AP round, is correctly modeled in shape and velocity curve. However, it's slightly underloaded. According to Soviet documents, it carried 125 grams of AYX-2, a powerful plastic explosive. In-game, that number drops to 115 grams, roughly 10 grams short, which slightly reduces its post-penetration damage. Velocity is also a bit off. Historically, the M65 gun fired the shell at 1,030 meters per second. In War Thunder, it's modeled at 1,000 meters per second. A small difference, but worth noting. And then, there's the infamous APDS rumor. Some players claim the Object 279 used a subcaliber round. One Reddit post even included a photo, but deeper research revealed that the image actually showed an 85mm experimental projectile from the AK Strela program. The most frequently cited Soviet source, Domestic Armored Vehicles 1945 to 1965, lists AP projectiles, but doesn't confirm any subcaliber variant. In fact, the source includes a disclaimer no APDS rounds were officially fielded. Other inconsistencies remain, like shell weight, listed as 30.7 kilograms in some sources, 33.4 kilograms in others, or barrel length, which varies between 56 and 60 calibers, depending on the reference. These variations could influence performance reconstructions, but they don't directly affect the core penetration calculations. As for the numbers, we reconstructed the BR-482B's performance using two historical tables and compared the results to War Thunder. At zero degrees, the game overestimates penetration by plus 13.9 to plus 15.9%. At 30 degrees, the deviation drops to plus 1.7 to plus 5.9%. And at 60 degrees, War Thunder actually underestimates the shell's performance between negative 7.6% and plus 2.1%. So, is the Object 279 accurate in War Thunder? Absolutely. Aside from small adjustments to explosive mass and velocity, it's one of the most thoroughly researched and faithfully implemented vehicles in the game. For once, the legend truly matches the gameplay. 